Galaxy S25 Ultra render shared by Tipster shows a flagship with more rounded corners than before, along with razor-thin bezels. Samsung was previously rumored to be testing four design prototypes of the Galaxy S25 Ultra, but it was likely that the company would stick with something different for next year. As shared by a tipster, a render of the Korean giant's top-end model shows that we will witness a flagship launch bearing slightly rounded corners, along with thinner bezels than before. As for why the company could be switching things up instead of sticking with the boxy design, we have a few reasons, so let us get right to them. Rounded corners on the Galaxy S25 Ultra will make it easier to grip, use, and store for prolonged periods. A boxier design may look crisp and pristine to some, but it can also cause an encumbrance during use, thanks to the sharp corners. Laptop makers often use this approach to cut down on manufacturing costs since it takes longer for machines to churn out a machine with rounded corners as opposed to sharper ones. However, ICE Universe has shared a new render of the Galaxy S25 Ultra stating that the flagship will do away with those sharper corners and transition to rounded ones. Samsung could market the Galaxy S25 Ultra as the Galaxy S25 Note, with a rumor claiming that the Plus moniker will also be changed. While it might be expensive for Samsung to mass-produce this chassis, there are various benefits to this design. The edged corners will not hurt when you have the Galaxy S25 Ultra stored in your pocket or prick you when you accidentally bump the corners on your hands or fingers. Aesthetically, Samsung's premium model may look identical to the upcoming iPhone 16 Pro Max, but the inclusion of the S Pen might add some additional functionality to the mix. The tipster previously mentioned that the Galaxy S25 Ultra will sport a design similar to the volatile Galaxy Note 7, and it will be thinner than the Galaxy S24 Ultra. Thankfully, the device will stick with the titanium chassis, but it will retain the Grade 2 variant thanks to the improved bonding process. The slimmer bezels will also mean that Samsung can reduce the Galaxy S25 Ultra's footprint without compromising on the screen real estate making it much easier to hold for those who have smaller hands. Honestly, we look forward to this design, but the boxy look will always have a special place in our hearts.